Welcome back guys to another episode of Let's Play XCOM Terror from the Deep. And as you can see we have a small ship down here that we shot down last episode. And we're gonna equip our guys with some more grenades. Like that. And we're also gonna sell off some stuff. Couple of cannons is never wrong to sell, and also we can sell a couple of grenades. And corpses, of course, we don't want them to take up valuable space in the general stores. That's everything we need to sell. We can remove this sub pen and build a workshop and another living quarters and other general stores. And can I remove this and this? No. Well, anyway, let's head down to this craft. And today I'm taking the tasers just in case. We are in the month that lobstermen really start to appear. And they are the last guy that I want to see today. And it's Gilman. So still no real danger, but still they can kill us. As you've seen before. utilize cover as much as possible now I'm guessing the ship is a um, large cruiser please hit okay fine don't hit and you took a shot to the head Nine turns to live. And you're all the way up there. And also one guy over there. Maybe Coplas can kill this guy. Almost. Shoot again, of course. How about Horst? Can you get close enough? Yes, you're good. Now, let's see how accurate I am. 66%. Not all, because I can't shoot at that angle. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Captain K sees one and kills. And now we are fighting the clock at the moment. And it's a medium cruiser. So Hopefully, there won't be that many left. But knowing my luck, 
there will probably be like five or so of them. one and I'm guessing and hoping that the last one is in the ship but as always with this game you never know if there's one more or ten more so we just have to trust my gut at the moment. And yep, yeah, one more guy. Two more guys, and you have... Hmm. Well, you... Okay, Copros, shoot this guy, thank you. And let's see, can we spot someone? Really? Fantastic. Just fantastic. And of course, no one else can shoot at him. Thank you. Two operate killed and two are very wounded. And I wonder how long we will have to have them in sick bay. 36 and 43 days. Yeah, well, you're not seeing action today let's see armor I figure you guys don't need them at the moment so and crew And I guess it was. Let's see here. I know that Copros, the great, died. And who else? Okay, Mephatu. It seems it was. Am I blind or something? Then it is Mackenzie. And now let's just hope that we don't run into more ships. Ion beam accelerators. Thank you.
and we can research sonic defenses just in case to try to attack us and not much happening at the moment which is kind of worrying let's see here sonic defense small one very fast small one and it's a large cruiser and let's equip our guys who's going to this mission stunning yam can come Armor. So, everyone got armor. Everyone got weapons. And let's wait for daytime. And let's raid this. Tasers, just in case. And tools. No one is here. Great. No one this way either. Fantastic. And someone is at or in the ship. And it's right there. Fantastic. Oh, come on, get out. And it seems like they are actually inside the ship and walking, so let's get closer and investigate. Not much movement at the moment. And again, it's Gilman. And Captain K gonna kneel down and take an aim shot at this guy. Because once again, I don't want to um, shoot with the guy who actually spots with the risk of return fire. Another guy there that I see and links. Can you shoot this guy? No, you could not. How about Mefatu? 72% should be able to hit. Nope. Not possible. Omnis Fate. And he scores. Captain K, proceed to explore. And I'm gonna go up to the entrance and hopefully no one will 
come out and greet me. Stunning gem. A lucky as always. has moved that would be these two guys so nothing happening I'm taking that as a sign as not many guys left There's probably just one guy in the back of the ship. Or there is one outside. soon find out hopefully at least we never know with this game gonna explore every part of it anyway just in case These are the parts when you would like to have a uh, particle disturbance sensor. Seriously, can't he show himself soon? And there, finally. There are two of them. There are three of them. And someone is lucky. Mackenzie Kloon surviving a grenade. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. guys shoot from here oh yes you could and you can shoot one more time and miss blinks misses too how about mefatu scores well 
thank you aliens for it yeah grouping up like that but don't please one live alien and what could that be Gilman squad leader that's quite awesome so I guess that will be the next thing we research but sadly that will be in the next episode so I'll see you then bye